Next ransom note, taking the Memphis mayor's race seriously. We have to. There is absolutely too much at stake. Luckily, everyone who's announced so far is a serious candidate. They all hold important positions, many of them elected positions, and they all want what's best for our city. Almost everyone. Unfortunately, canceled former TV judge Joe Brown has decided to run as well. And tonight, when he was asked since there are more women than men in Memphis, shouldn't a woman run for mayor? Brown's response was this. Some things men do real well, and one of the main problems is I don't want to get crude about it, but some places you need to go to exercise leadership, some of the good ladies in here would get drugged into an abandoned apartment and raped. That's one of the problems. Meanwhile, these rape kits that have not... You heard the groans there. See, he is not a serious candidate, and I wish he'd cancel his campaign just like network executives did with his TV show almost a decade ago. That is not likely to happen, so it's up to us, voters and the news media, not to take him seriously. In 2014, when Brown ran against Amy Wyrick to be district attorney, he questioned her sexual orientation and said it was time for her to come out of the closet. The remark got way too much publicity back then. This year, we should all follow Wyrick's response back then. She said, my family didn't sign on to be part of the Judge Joe Brown show. Amen to that. Join the conversation by email or my Facebook and Twitter pages.